Hey, what up, you two dudes? I'm Chris from Restaurants, and today I'm gonna bring you a little haul that I got. First, I'm gonna start with two comics, really cheap, <laughs> 20 cents each. So, first comic is Domino. I think it's our four issues for this uh, comic. And I have the first one, so it's pretty cool. The second comic is, uh, <laughs> what the hell is this? Mechanics. I really don't know what the hell it is, but it's the last part. It seems that it's, uh, they have uh, six parts of this, and I have the last one, so that's nice. Okay, next uh, I'm gonna show you some games that my wife uh, gave me from. Uh, they were supposed to be from his brother, but now they're mine. <laughs> they're gonna be games from my uh, Game Boy. The first one, Tom and Jerry. The second one, uh, World Cup. This game is pretty awesome on Nintendo and uh, Game Boy as well. Bonks a danger. Also, they gave me another Tetris game. I already have one, so it's cool to have two. Football. Pretty awesome. Play action football. And, uh, Team Ninja Turtles. Follow the Foot Clan. Seems like somebody put a sticker and then take it out and damage this. And, uh, this uh, Pac Man, but it's broken from here. The little case. And stuff. Super Mario Land 2. I have number one, so it's cool to have number two. Also, she gave me a uh, Game Gear. Pretty cool, it has the covers. I have one with no covers, cool to have this one. And this one had uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2, I have Sonic the Hedgehog 1, so it's cool to have number 2. So pretty cool, if it works, not a chance. I have also another Game Boy, but it doesn't turn on as well. Baseball game, and I pick up this uh, game the other day, I just pick it up because it has a case. 20 cents. <laughs> I really hate golf, man. What the hell is wrong with people? That's it for Sega. Alright, time for more Nintendo. The other day, a friend of mine come home and bring me this stuff. This is really beat up, man. It works, but uh, it's really beat up. Graffiti on it. Pipe Dream, bulletproof software. Sky or Die. I remember when I played this game. Check this cover, man. Old. And a uh, baseball game. But the cool part is that he bring me this too. Team Engineering Tools 2, I already have this one on, on card, pretty awesome, and the little box that it came with. And Epicness, the other area I played dudes, first time that I played since a long time ago, and I almost passed it, but the last boss beat me the hell out of me, man. It just stressed me the hell out of it, and I uh, give up, but I'm gonna play it again, so I'm gonna do a video of this game because I love it, just awesome. Alright, time for DVDs. I grabbed this uh, DVD and a dollar. <laughs> Big Troll in Little China. Pretty awesome. Another DVD for my collection. Awesomeness. I grabbed this. Stan Lee's Mutants, Monsters and Marvels. What the hell is that, man? With filmmaker Kevin Smith. Pretty cool. Yeah, I just also one dollar, man. Next, G.I. Joe. Resolute, or I don't know what the hell that is. Also one dollar. Epicness, my friends. Ghost in the Shell. Hell yeah! This is an awesome anime, if you haven't watched it. Pretty awesome. And also one freaking dollar, I just couldn't believe it. Well, ten pesos each. Well, I'm just gonna say one dollar. Uh, Ghost in the Shell, man. It's just awesome freaking anime. The Bundooks. Uncut and uncensored. What not? Hilarious. I haven't watched this. I always wanted to pick it up and I just thought <laughs> on one dollar, dude. Hell yeah. Well, ten pesos. So it has the three DVDs. This DVD has one to five episodes. This two has six to ten. And the last one has eleven to fifteen. So I don't know how much seasons or whatnot this is, but I, this is the first one. So pretty cool. Yes, it is. A head of a turtle. And it seems that it's Mikey. Uh, this is from for my sister. Uh, she gave it to me. It's a little playground here for the turtles. I have a bunch of little turtles that uh, that Limbo sent me. It's pretty cool to have a bunch of them here. So yeah, I'm gonna put it there on display later on. I'm gonna show you all my turtles. I don't have where to put them, but uh, I think I'm gonna use my my table and put all of them so you can watch them with all the accessories. The world has to know that I have them. <laughs> Thanks to my sister. Have this. Thanks, sis. I don't know what the hell I pay this, but uh, I bought it just because it looks cool. <laughs> it's a little playground, it's from Playmates, I don't know from where. 
but it looks cool. This you can take this out, or put it in if you like. I bought it because I have a this, this turtles, so they kind of look cool on this. But this is too small for them. So I'm just gonna remove this and put it like this. It's a cool stand for the turtles. Oh yeah, still need the other two of these guys. Need Raphael and Mikey. I grabbed Mikey from Turtle Turtles. The only one that is missing right now from my collection is Leo from the Turtle Turtles. So that's pretty epic. I found this little dude and I just pick it up right away. Not Tech Tech Dude. Well, I'm not into Tech Tech Dudes, but bought it because uh, 20 cents, by the way. I bought it because it has magnets and uh, just in case and I need more magnets, I'm gonna use this magnets of this guy. <laughs> John Cena, my mom bought it uh, on her local flea market the other day that I went to the, her home. She got this guy and I said, hey, what's up, mom? Give it to me. It's pretty cool. The cool part of this is this guy looks like him, man. Just look at the face. Just like, almost identical. That's my only new wrestler that I have. I'm really not into the figures. I want to have um, the, the cool ones. The Rock, Steve Austin, Ultimate Warrior. Macho Man, Hulk Hogan, maybe Rey Mysterio. Oh yeah, my mom got me this figure from Lord of the Rings. I think it's uh, Pippin or whatever the other name guy was. I have another Lord of the Rings figure. I think the original Frodo and the other two little hobbits. Finally, I got my World War Hulk. Got it at my local Walmart. About, I think it's gonna be like nine bucks. Cost me 120 pesos. I already took it out of the box, sorry guys. Here has a picture of Hulk, and everybody has uh, this box. So, let's take a look at the freaking figure. So there we have it, Hulk, with his accessories. The shield got a little bit bent, but it's cool. And I have the base, base Hulk, number three, pretty cool. Alright, also I got my Winter Soldier. This guy I got it like for four bucks. It was new on the box, it was just a little bit open. It has the little file and whatnot and uh, the base as well. Comes with the accessories, the rifle, and the gun that you can take it off from this holster. And here we have the base, Winter Soldier. Here we have Ronin, friend of mine picked this guy for me. Cost 50 cents. I grabbed two swords that I have before from my own little figure. And uh, well, it looks kind of cool with this guy, so there you go. And yeah, remember Logan, I put the hand here and it has like a little finger, trigger finger. So as you can see now Wolverine has a gun and it looks pretty nice with the trigger finger. Oh yeah, and I grabbed this tiny little Godzilla. It's a pretty cool. Tiny Godzilla. 